divas, divas, divas. This is your girl Tronda with Upgrade My Diva. And today I am bringing you the cheat code for self-taught designers. As I have found the system. If you want to learn more on how this system is the cheat code for fashion design, stay tuned. Don't take it personal, I ain't lying. Okay guys, welcome back. So I know it's been a minute since I posted a video, but content is on the way. With that being said, this particular pattern system I have been wanting to review for quite some time, but just <laughs> procrastination, consistency, things that we're working on for 2021 has been in the way, but finally I'm ready to bring it to you guys. I have been using it for almost a year now it's been about six months or so since i purchased it and i am so happy with this purchase it has been a game changer for me when it comes to drafting patterns for those who have not went to school for fashion design it can be hard trying to figure out the best way to draft patterns and to do it the appropriate professional way we have to do a lot of things quick and dirty that may not necessarily be the right way but it's how we get it done and that's cool <laughs> However, come. If you're wanting to take your business or your design skill to the next level, then you need to know how to draft patterns and translate them not only in your size, but to different sizes. The Learn Low Pattern System is a system I believe that was created in like the UK, I want to say Germany. It was a system created to allow the at home sewer the ability to draft patterns in various sizes just based off of two measurements so for this pattern system you only need to know the bust and the hip measurement of yourself or whomever you're drafting the pattern for and that is enough to create hundreds of patterns guys and so for those of us who are used to purchasing commercial patterns we're used to the bust waist hip measurements being used and every now and then those patterns may not necessarily always come out right and in some cases they may not make our size in the particular style we're looking for so i was really intrigued by this pattern because it's only two measurements and all of the sizes um, can be drafted at any given opportunity you don't have to worry about purchasing multiple patterns to get the sizes that you may or may not need in the future so that's why I love this system now I won't say that this pattern system is perfect that you're going to draft the perfect pattern every single time there may be some some tweaks that are needed but just to be able to draft the pattern in general is already a win so let me just go into my pros really quick it's very beginner friendly only takes two measurements and you can draft any pattern that comes in the starter kit you can also add your own design element. So as y'all can see from this particular design, this was a sweatshirt dress that was in my fall winter collection that I drafted using this pattern system. It was not a dress that was this the same exact style. I added a lot of my own elements, but it just goes to show that if you have the creativity in mind, you can draft whatever pattern you're looking if you just got the basic shape down. So I love that about it. And it's a lot of value for the starter pack. The pack that I received had over 200 patterns in it and I was astonished because I'm like I don't know if I'm ever use all these patterns but just <laughs> the amount of patterns was enough for me to be like it's mine because even if I took advantage of the dollar sale and the 99 cent sale of your commercial patterns it would not it would still be more cost more to do that than to buy the amount of patterns that are in this book so that are the pros now the cons. The sewing instructions are very general. They are assuming that you know the very basics of constructing a garment. So it's gonna go over the very basics of how to construct just about every garment in the book. But they're not going to be individual sewing instructions for each pattern. So a lot of it is kind of figure it out on your own trial and error. But again, if you have experience sewing, if you have experience even attempting commercial patterns, then I don't feel like you'll have a hard time following this. Some of the patterns that are given with the pattern system, as far as the pictures they provide of what the garment looks like, the inspirational photo, it's a little dated. I will admit um, some of them look a little, a little vintage. <laughs> but again, if you go in with the imagination of this can become what I want it to become, then really you just begin to, to search for 
just the general shape or general idea of the look you're going for and building from there. Also, the thing I found, there's there's not many people that have reviewed or given tutorials on this particular pattern system. If you look it up on YouTube, uh, there's not a ton of videos and, if there, and the videos that are out there are very old. Some of them are in different languages. And so it's hard to find a lot of tutorials. Now I do belong to a Facebook group for this pattern system. Um, and it's pretty much with a lot of home stores of all, you know, internationally. And they do tend to have uh, Facebook Lives talking about particular pattern um, things with the pattern system but outside of that there's not really a lot of uh, up-to-date knowledge about the pattern system outside of what you can kind of find on YouTube and through different communities so that was the only kind of cons I had and as you can see I don't have many but I still feel like it is a upgrade my diva step of approval to purchase this system now the system I purchased was the ultimate pack it had like I said 280 plus patterns and it came with the entire system and instructions on how to draft the patterns that system at the time I purchased was $179.99 if you search little low pattern system on the Google's on the internet you'll find various websites that sell the system um, the one I purchased mine from was the Canada website of Little Low System. But there's also the Golden Rule, which is kind of the uh, the tagline for this particular pattern system. It's called the Golden Rule. Us, I believe, is the website. You can purchase it from there as well. I'll put a few links in the description box and on screen to mention that. But yeah, get into it, guys. I highly, 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 highly recommend. For me as a designer who sews for purchase, it has been a lifesaver for me because it allows me to draft patterns in various sizes without having to get a ton of measurements. Now, do I still measure for the gods? I do, because it helps with me knowing what I may have to tweak once I draft my pattern. But in regards to me being intimidated about whether or not I'll be able to figure out the correct pattern technique to get this pattern the way I want it. I don't have that fear anymore. I don't have to think about, oh my God, drafting a different pants pattern in a different size and worried about this crotch honey and whether or not it's gonna to be together or not, whether or not the fit, whether or not it's gonna fall correct on the body. Like a lot of those things I don't have to worry about or it took a lot, decreased the amount of fear I had in those things because I have a basic pattern block to start from. Now, unfortunately the book does not necessarily have any basic blocks so you don't have like a basic bodice pants skirt or anything to to draft from but like I said if you're looking at the different pattern designs you'll start to see the ones that are that you can kind of use to draft the basic block and again create your own style lines and things of that nature to make it your own so I'm going to zoom in to show you guys the book and if you would love a tutorial or like a tutorial on how I use this pattern system and how I design my own looks from the patterns in this book leave a comment below give me a thumbs up subscribe to the channel whatever just show me that you're interested so i'll know to continue with this content of giving you tutorials on this particular pattern system so let's go ahead and do a zoom in of the materials okay guys so this is how you receive or how i received my luder low system Again, this is an international pattern system that was developed in 1935. So you'll get this nice binder that holds all of your um, tools and patterns. You can see I have a lot of stickies of different patterns I liked. So let's just look at the book. So first off, the very thing you'll get very, uh, the very first thing you'll notice is how to do the pattern um, making system. In. It gives you a quick brochure that goes over very quickly at a high level of how you create patterns. It's very simple, short to the point. It also comes with a DVD that goes over this exact same pattern that it gives you the demo on how to make. You also receive a cardboard um, French curve ruler that you can use for the system. And then you get this. So I don't have my freaking measuring tape. What I do with it? But you'll get a measuring tape, and the measurements are in the metric system, so it's in centimeters. I'm sorry, let me turn it the right way. <laughs> you'll get a measuring tape. You get a marking pen to uh, mark your pattern paper. You get two thumbtacks, and you get scotch tape. 
this is all used to draft your patterns. The uh, measuring tape, let me grab that. Okay, so this is the measuring tape you'll get in the kit. So like I said, it's in centimeters and basically this uh, first portion of the measuring tape gives you all of the different measurements uh, from lowest to highest that you will take on your waist, I'm sorry, your bust and your hips. And basically you're just placing your thumbtack in the corresponding hole of the measurement based on the type of pattern you're doing and you're connecting the dots. So this is a, a, a connect dot dot pattern system. It's very easy to follow once you get the hang of it. If you're not used to measuring in centimeters, then that's something else you, that's a kind of a curve. But again, if you're used to measuring, you'll figure it out. So that's what you receive. And then the first portion of the binder kind of just is your thank you. And then it goes over again, how to utilize the pattern system. It also goes over instructions on hold it so you can see it. It goes over instructions of what the different, uh, the legends on the pattern means and what the different symbols mean. It also gives you the very basic sewing instructions based on what you're creating. Again, if you kind of know the basics of sewing, you'll pretty much get the hang of this. And then once you get through all of the instruction work, is when the actual pattern starts. So typically you will see, uh, for the pattern, it has the pattern numbers down here, and then it has all these different coding um, that you can look in the legend to figure out what they mean. It basically just kind of indicates if it's a top or bottom, if it's considered an accessory, uh, things of that nature. You'll see the picture of the pattern, and then on the back of that pattern sheet is where you'll see the actual pattern pieces that you would need to draft. And so you basically just take this out your binder, adjust your, um, or um, align your pattern paper, align it to your pattern paper, put the, uh, thumbtack with the corresponding measurement into the portion marked with the X on the pattern piece and then you literally just go dot by dot drafting the dots on your pattern paper and connect all the dots again if you guys want a tutorial on this say so in the comments below and I will uh, I can do a tutorial but that's pretty much it like I said it's a variety of patterns they do have a few in here that are four plus size but they also sell supplemental pattern packs that you can purchase with additional patterns and they have some specifically for a plus size if you want to do that they also have a pattern system specifically for plus size that basically just gives you a longer measuring tape for sizes that may go beyond what's on there I know I'm a size uh, 20 standard and my size was on the regular size but if you want to go beyond the size 20 then you may want to get the plus size pattern system that will give you the longer tape and I believe you can also buy the longer tape separately the other thing to point out is that there is no seam allowance built into any of these patterns so whatever standard seam allowance you typically use you will have to add to the pattern once you draft it the great news is is that from a knit a knit fabric perspective you are going to have some patterns that will have a knit um, like for instance this has a curvy silhouette that lets you know that this is ideal for curvy women to wear but again that's just their opinion you don't have to follow it but then you will see like little um, icons like this that um, it's a picture of like a sweater knit that lets you know that that particular pattern can be made out of knit fabric what I will say is that you can pretty much make any pattern um, that's in this book out of knit fabric and you don't necessarily even have to add the seam allowance since you're allowing for ease and stretch so that's what I've been doing and it's worked for me so that is the pattern system guys I absolutely love it definitely a worthy investment for those looking to take their sewing game up to the next level or um, whether it be your at home source sewing for yourself or you're someone looking to so for clients, I think that it is a worthy investment. So with that being said, if you have any questions about this pattern system or you want to purchase a system for yourself, feel free to follow the link in the description box or on the screen. If you would like a tutorial on how I use this pattern system, feel free to comment below. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for your continued support and patience as I grow my content here on YouTube and my business. Thank you guys for following me on this journey. Don't take it personal. I ain't lying. I